<laughs> All right, what's going on, folks? Uh, shooting another video update for today, Tuesday. Uh, we're here in uh, January. Yeah, as you notice, I am driving. I'm a delivery driver uh, here part-time. If that's something you're interested in doing, um, feel free to follow me on Twitter, at Fast2Future. That's at Fast, the number two, Future. And uh, you can reach out to me there. I'm actually going to be helping out a few folks uh, get enrolled and getting started. Uh, if you are somebody that's already driving and you're interested in uh, in uh, growing like a business, like, you know, with a YouTube channel, well, that's something we're going to be doing. So um, I'm just giving you an update. So this week, uh, I actually, we were retiring an older, one of the older vehicles. Uh, you know, I live here in the Northeast. You get rust um, underneath your... Uh, you know, under, underneath and you know, just that's what happens when they salt the roads up here. So, um, hey, I know this video is dark, but you know, it's uh, five o'clock or whatever, 5.30 it is, and it is dark up here. So, um, yeah, so we gotta deal with it. All right, so if you notice, uh, my, my main push is, I just started looking into, you know, potentially growing up the YouTube channel. And uh, I think the goal is I wanna get monetized. And so, a thousand subscribers if you're not a subscriber please subscribe to the channel definitely want to have you aboard and my ultimate goal of this channel is to help you guys no matter where you are in life no matter what you do uh, for a living is to help you guys grow uh, your income and, 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 and be able to move forward and faster um, whatever you're doing we're gonna be talking a lot about YouTube I just think it's a great venue so I'll just kind of share my thoughts why YouTube is the second largest um, search engine right a lot of times if you're searching what do you do you go to google you know or you go to youtube and you look up a video on it that's why i'm so bullish i actually you know it's weird i'll just give you a little background don't make the same mistakes i did when opportunities present and you've got the time you know seize them so years ago this is back in like 2009 i actually that was the first time that i really thought about building out a youtube channel and uh i should have just stuck with it because i was getting uh, putting out videos, ranking them on the top page. I was using a, a ranking software that was putting me, you know, in Google sometimes in like less than 20 minutes. Uh, and I was getting leads, you know, to my capture pages and whatnot. For whatever reason, you know, maybe I was just young, maybe I just got ahead of myself. I, I didn't continue doing what, what was working. Um, and I just kept continue, you know, life got in the way, I did other things. But I'm standing here today, well, I'm not standing, I'm sitting here because I'm driving, but you get the, you get the idea. You know, nothing has really changed. If anything, it's just, it's solidified itself even more. I was watching a, um, you guys familiar with Mr. Beast? Uh, Mr. Beast has a, a tremendous uh, following on YouTube. You know, he's got how many videos, getting over 100 million views. I was watching, he was doing an interview with uh, Lex Friedman, another Friedman, however you want to say his name. You know, he dresses up in a suit and he interviews folks. But, uh, you know, this is a platform. It's, uh, it's only growing. And, you know, when you're with a, a company that basically, I mean, Google, if you will, has the lion's share of the web, um, you know, now it's easier more than ever. And so what I find interesting, you still build out a channel, creating videos the way you used to, but the algorithm has changed, right? Like er, back in the early days, as long as I had a few keywords, you know, pretty much good to go. You know, then they started moving towards watch time. They wanted to know like, hey, all right, we don't want to just show your video, but we want, you know, are people watching your video are they staying on your video retention so like if you're still watching this video right now right we're like three minutes and 45 seconds into it you know then hey <laughs> you're here but you know for the folks that click off they'll never know what's going to be coming next right so youtube shorts why am i so excited about it well if you've been uh, familiar with like tiktok or these instagram reels or whatnot these short form right usually like a minute or less 30 seconds video content seems to be all the craze and I think that this is uh, YouTube's push to try and compete so it seems like their overall algorithm you know is going to be heavily you know it, it, it does it does favor I mean I put up a video yesterday you know just sharing a Bible verse you know it was, it was a YouTube short you know it's got 120 something views already in 24 hours um, you know what's interesting is you you create these shorts you, you don't do any keywords i mean i guess you could in the title but that's all they give you is just the title and then click you're, you're you're up and you're running so i've been looking at different ways and strategies that we can utilize these youtube shorts and again with the monetization occurring here in february i think this is a pretty cool and pretty you know early enough platform where uh you know i could see people 
creating, um, you know, just channels in, in very short period of time and hopefully making some, some ad revenue and beyond. Um, but we're going to get into that. I still myself, so obviously, like I said, I'm not like completely new when it comes to social media, but I am new in the regard that, you know, I haven't really been taking it seriously in a while to even, you know, monetize or even sort of think about this. I started this channel, you know, just because I wanted to start sharing some information, you know, that I was learning in crypto and blockchain, which is, you know, another major kind of interest of mine. And I think, uh, you know, we grew in hundreds and hundreds of followers. So here we are, I'm, you know, almost 600 followers. My goal is I'd like to get to a thousand uh, followers. And that was, I was doing, you know, what I did so far without even trying. So I was just putting up content, you know, whatever interested me and whatnot. But now that, you know, there's smarter, more efficient ways of doing it. So last night I was looking at uh, probably two browser extensions that I'll be trying to hook up in, in short order. Tube Buddy and VidIQ. Uh, what are they? Well, basically work smarter, not harder. So if you want to grow out any channel, right? It's all, you want to get eyeballs, but you really want to get targeted eyeballs and you want to know, well, what are people actually out there looking for, right? You don't want to just do what I was doing. I mean, I was creating, yeah, but I was just putting whatever you know title I felt like. I wasn't really doing any research to find out, well, hey, what are people actually looking for? So then I can, you know, you know, put my titles and descriptions around that. So, you know, obviously that's a smarter thing to do. And that's why, you know, if I was starting over, you know, with this intent of, you know, growing quickly, I probably would, uh, you know, be using these tools right off the bat. Then there's marketing, right? There's there's and there's going to be a lot of things that we can do. The goal is to automate it. I've mentioned IFTT. It's an app that you can simply set up one time. It's if this then that. So basically, what it means is, you know, you set up if I post a YouTube video, then, you know, automatically post it on all my other, you know, blogs, my Twitters, my socials, my you know whatever it might be. Hey, you might get some more extra buy eyeballs. And it's running right in the background. You set it up one time. I have that going. I set that up years ago. Um, you know, I just never really thought about it. Never. And you know what, what? What amazes me is when I first started this journey years ago, just kind of looking into it. Like I said, I mean, there's softwares out there that just blew my mind. I haven't even been actively looking. So I can't imagine what is out there today, especially, you know, with these new and improved AI uh, systems. And so. That's, that brings me to, you know, to you and, and, and where we can work together. Um, you know, and for now, this is gonna be free. I'm just looking for people that, that are serious, people that wanna mastermind, you know, on a daily or weekly basis, you do it at your own pace. Um, but I'm looking for people that really wanna share ideas so we can get there faster. Um, and so for now, you know, I'm saying, hey, if you're watching this and that's you, uh, connect with me on Twitter. And the reason I'm saying Twitter is just because to me, that's the easiest thing right now. Um, you know, so I don't have to check through all the comments all the time here, you know, even though I, I do read the comments, um, you know, but I, if, you know, if you watch this video a couple weeks from now, maybe I'll miss something. So if you can send me a message on Twitter and you let me know, hey, Justin, I've been following you. I like what you're up to. I'd like to be a part of it. Um, I'm going to say, great, you know, all right, let's get started. I think what I'm going to do is I want to set up Twitter spaces. Um, that way, even if we just start with just a handful of people, maybe one, two, three people to start, maybe we got a group of 10, 20, it doesn't matter, but then we can start brainstorming. Uh, ideas and moving forward and then you know we literally got a little team uh, that's working you know for everybody's good and, and that's what I like so um, that's my goal to set up I, like I said I'm being realistic I don't know how long it's gonna take me to do any of this you know I mean organically it's probably taken me a little over a year probably to get to the channel YouTube channel at this point um, maybe it'll be faster maybe it'll be slower obviously my goal is faster you know but but I do other things in life and uh, you know until I can get to the point where you know, I've got bills paid and I've got enough income where I can focus, you know, heavily and, you know, more in depth on, you know, I'm going to take it at the pace that makes sense. And I, you know, I would always urge people to do that, right? Nothing I say is financial advice. You guys know your own lives. But uh, I do know that, you know, teamwork makes the dream work. So, um, yeah, so that's that. You know, if you're looking for some other side hustles or, you know, things depending on your situation, you know, there's things that I'm doing and maybe there's things that uh, we could talk about. Um, you know, I also do a few other things. I'm a certified, you know, teacher. I, you know, I do tutoring here on the side, and you know, for SATs. You know, maybe you're watching this and you know somebody, or maybe you got a, you know, one of your child, who, you know, in high school or college. Maybe they need some help. Let me know. Maybe I can help them out over Zoom or something. Um, even if it's SAT 
tutoring. I mean, I've done, you know, boot camps, you know, in front of hundreds of people, etc. You know, I also do buying and selling and stuff like that. Um, and cryptocurrency, um, you know, that's a whole different animal. But, uh, you know, that's that. You know, I don't give financial advice, but in my previous uh, endeavors, I, I did an internship with a top 10 Ernst & Young uh, internship in America, you know, for financial planning. So I got licensed uh, back in the day. I'm not, you know, I, I don't do that anymore. But, uh, you know, that kind of got me. Then I studied finance and economics at Princeton. So I, you know, I had some really good, um, you know, professors that kind of just showed me certain things. And, you know, my in the last 10 or 15 years, I've really been thinking a lot about technology. And that's kind of where my journey was. How do you make technology go better? I got more stories I could share with you. You know, I spoke to, you know, the CEO of the fastest growing company in the United States. I've spoken to the top marketers, you know, with companies like that uh, and that company. You know, and I just kind of push back sometimes because to me, I was growing up in this internet you know, age, but a lot of these people were dragging their feet. You know, what I'm realizing is I just didn't take enough action, right? And so if you're watching this video, yeah, it's one thing just to talk about it, but now it's action time. And so for me, I realize nothing's going to manifest in my life if I don't continue, continue to take, you know, more and more action. And sometimes it's just, you know, sometimes life gets in the way. Sometimes you're tired. Sometimes, you know, it's, you know, you don't get the results as quick or as fast as you're looking for. And maybe you get, you know, a little down dejected. I'm real, right? That's me too, guys, right? That's why what I'm saying is like, you know, I'm no different than nobody else. I mean, all I know are the facts. You know, all I know is right now at the time of this recording, you know, I've got a YouTube channel like this that I started just for fun. And now I'm almost 600 subscribers. I'm so grateful, you know, for the folks there. And, uh, you know, I want to start stepping it up and I want to be more intentional uh, this year. I want to, you know, be more intentional about an online presence. And really what it came down to when I really thought about it, it's like, I, I feel like there's no escaping it. I mean, I've been saying to myself, you know, the robots are going to be taking our jobs. I mean, this is the, the trend that's coming. Yeah, there'll be a lot of new jobs that open up that we've never even heard of. I mean, who would have thought of been, you know, being a YouTube influencer, you know, years ago? I mean, you know, a lot of people didn't even realize that was a viable career. And what I'm realizing is, you know, now it's just here. And so if, if you don't have, you know, a plan for the future and you're not building towards it today, you know, I don't know. I mean, what, what is what is your plan? But, you know, for me, I'd like to be able to have a group of people that have seen me, you know, over the years, see see who I am, see what I'm working towards, so that things, when they do change, you know, people will kind of be like, oh yeah, you know, we remember that guy who was talking about, you know, these crypto projects, you know, years before anybody else, or he was talking about YouTube, uh, you know, or YouTube Shorts, or YouTube Channel, or YouTube Automation, years before, you know, and that's that's what we're trying to do here. Um, so, anyways. I gotta let you go. I'm, I'm currently on a delivery right now, so that's another thing. I'm just trying to utilize my time the best I can. I know that you know the video quality in the dark. You know it is what it is, but you know I'm hoping that you know the smart people. Hopefully you're one of them. You guys can look through. You know, you know what the lighting is and all this, and you, you're hearing the words. Do you hear the words that are coming out of my mouth? Right. I mean that's a joke, but uh, you know. But seriously, I mean, you know, if you're getting value from this stick around definitely you know subscribe to the channel um and if you really are one of those real go-getters and you really want to know what we're doing day by day basis like i said either write a comment or more importantly connect with me uh and um you know then uh, you know we'll be talking in maybe in twitter spaces or somewhere else uh and i really would like to uh, see how we can help one another so anyways see you later guys enjoy the rest of the day um i'm gonna try and do a few more orders if i can make a little bit of money and then uh, later this week we are uh, getting a new, well, it's not a new vehicle, it's newer to me. You know, it's an older vehicle, but, uh, you know, it's getting some work done in the shop the next couple of days, and then, uh, you know, back to the races again. So, you know, it is what it is. See you guys. Peace.